Contract accepted. Very nice. Yeah, what's up, Sheila? I think I underestimated the Pawnee militia. They've gone high tech. They've even tapped into the CTOS. Hmm. I've got a lock on one of the vehicles they're using to hack in. But there's a problem. Well, I love a good problem. Let's hear it. They've got a limited range. You get the car outside that range, they won't be able to fry the components remotely, and we get to dissect them. And what's stopping them from frying it as soon as I take the thing? Speed. If you're moving fast enough, they can't get a lock on it. Pedal to the metal, then. I can do that. Okay. Here's the car. This is gonna be a race mission. You gotta maintain a speed. I don't know how hard it is. Let's see. Oh boy. No! I made it. Holy shit. This is wild. This is like the movie Speed. What? Well, I forget it. A fucking little tree stopped me, dude. A little tree stopped me. <laughs> a little fucking tree. Not the fence. A tiny little tree. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> of course. Remember that, ladies and gentlemen. Tiny little trees will stop a car in their tracks. <laughs> Try this again. Oh, we actually got music this time. Oh my god! A random ass fucking stupid fire engine that time. <laughs> A fucking fire truck. Damn it. I knew this was gonna be hard. This is gonna be fucking hard, man. God damn it. Go. Try again. I've got the need. The need for speed. down. 22. 23. 24. 25. 26. 27. Oh. Did it. Okay. Phew. You dropped off the grid. Yeah. I delivered the prize. Haven't driven like that since college when we used to play 30-30. Woo-wee. Do I the really want to know... No, probably not. I'll make sure this car is taken apart so we can figure out how they're tapping in. Thanks, mystery man. No problem. You know what? You have anything else like this on your plate, you just let me know. Nicely done. Okay. 
2,500 bucks. Leaderboards. Who did the fastest? Someone probably didn't hit a car at all. Let's look. If it uh, loads, what the hell? It's taking forever. Hello? Damn! Told you, they probably didn't hit anything. Fuck. Okay, so. That's it, we've done all the Street Sweep missions now. At least one of every type, you know what I mean? There are new ones, say, different ones, but we've already did one of every type. Oh, what is this? An online street sweep. Complete your current contracts and daily contracts with another player. So it's co-op. Okay, I did hear about this, that there was an online co-op component. Hmm. Alright, I want to continue on with the story, so let's fast travel down here and get back on track now that we did a little bit of side content. Here we go. That co-op, son. <clears throat> the needs of the few. The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. That is the saying, how it goes. Hello. Okay, let's see what this is about. <sighs> Tobias always did know how to get my goat. But he's stuck with me, so he's gonna have to deal. If there's a chance I can get him out of this... <sighs> I owe it to him to try. Hmm. I'm giving up a hell of a lot to do it, too. Like, for all I know, he's probably already split on me. Shit. Banned from Willis Tower? <laughs> How do you get banned from Willis Tower? You fucking flash people up there or something? <laughs> She's drunk as shit. Got into trouble. All right, let's talk to Tobias. Huh? Oh, there we go. All right. Oh, where the hell is he? Ray, this place is amazing. I, I can't believe you live here. <laughs> Lived. I'm past my checkout time. So we need to figure out what Bloom offered for your contract and who they paid. I need a way back into Bloom's system, but our date last night ended messy. <clears throat> so I'm hoping to find a CTOS access point that's a little less armed. Your old think tank. Is it still there? Bloom Forge? Yep, still there. Sometimes I raid their garbage for spare parts. Don't underestimate that place. It may have started as a hacker space, but Bloom poured in money. Do not underestimate these guys. Expect engineering gone wild. Mad science on a corporate budget. Yeah, I think I can handle a few nerds with expensive toys. <laughs> I'm bringing Eugene. <clears throat> oh shit, remember Eugene? <clears throat> Alright, we're gonna see where this thing goes. Even further down, to the sub-basement. Huh. Here, boy! You have a dog? I'm allergic to dogs. He's not a dog. Well, I'm allergic to cats, too. Uh. <clears throat> Damn, this place is huge. It's like an obstacle course or something. I kinda wanna give it a look. Oh, now you know what's gonna happen later. Later on, we're going to get attacked here, and we're going to have to defend this area. I mean, it's a sh obvious, pretty freaking obvious. Aha. Uh -huh. <clears throat> or else why would all these booby traps, like, burst and everything be around here, you know? Anything here? Nope. I get over there. All 
Right here. Staircase. <clears throat> oh, Eugene! <laughs> a freaking... What do they call that? An RC car? Or it's RC, in this case, and I don't know if you call it a car. I guess you call it an RC car. Eugene! He calls his little, his little contraptions, he names them like they're pets. I guess if you were a techie hacker type and that's all you did for your hobby, you probably would consider it like a pet, you know? Okay. I'm all set for Bloomforge. If the doorbell rings, don't answer it. <laughs> I don't think these guys use doorbells anyway. Going up. Okay, so where are we headed to do this mission? Let's find out. Ooh. Whoa, way freaking north. Holy shit, dude. Can you fast travel? You can't fast travel. Yeah, you gotta go there. Fuck. That is gonna be a drive. That sucks. Alright. Alright.